Hey, good morning. It's time for your weekly kick. There's a lot of talk about values and how important it is to hold company values and individual values and to base our decisions on these things. Well, one of the values that many of us choose is safety. Because if we don't have a, a value of safety, and it doesn't matter if our people go home safe at night, that with everything working and alive, then everything we've done during the day is, a, is really a waste. It's worse than a waste. It's a disaster because safety has to be a priority. Just give me a second here. I'll be right back. I gotta head up in the lift for a second and I'll be right back. Now hopefully you got a little bit cynical with me because I just finished talking about how important the value of safety is and yet I was just about to climb into that bucket and head up without any safety equipment. Well, how often do we do that as leaders? We say one thing is a value, one thing is important. Quality, it might be production, it might be any number of things. Integrity, honesty, teamwork. And then all of a sudden we act in a way when the chips are down, when things get tough, when things get tight, when the pressure's on, we act in opposition to that value. One of the most important things we need to do as a leader is to model the values that we hold. If one of our values is safety, and hopefully for most of us or all of us, that is one of our values as a company and as a leader, that safety is an incredibly important value, then we need to model it. Whether people are around, because there's nobody around here right now, or whether they're not, we need to model it. Because if we don't, what happens is we create a strong sense of cynicism. Our people won't have that value anymore. The people we lead won't see safety as a value or production or honesty or integrity. What they will see is that we don't actually do what we say we're going to do. What we do doesn't match our values. And they become cynical and it becomes a joke. It's something they mock us about. Our values matter. We usually spend a lot of time coming to a conclusion of what our top five or top seven values are. And these things actually matter to us as individuals and as leaders and as companies. So the challenge is to model the values that we hold as companies, as leaders, and as individuals. So that matter, no matter who's watching or isn't watching, they will see the same thing. We will be consistent. Our values make a difference in how we act, and people can count on that. So, good luck in doing this, and we'll see you next Tuesday at your weekly kick.